All right, you guys, let's figure out how to use the number 100 to help us subtract when we're working with hundreds. So see what I mean. So you're gonna click on this link and it'll look like this, break apart. And we're gonna go to subtract and we're gonna use 100 this time. Let's click the easy version, although it's not that easy. But once you start practicing it, it will get better. So I'm gonna go here and go, all right, 110 minus 20. Well, 110, I can drop that down to 100 if I could just take this 10 off. So I'm gonna say, all right, I wanna take that 10 off, but I need to take 20. So if I take a 10 off of 20, how much will I have left? So 10 plus 10 is 20, and I break the 20 up this way so I can do 110 minus 10 is 100. Now if I'm at 100 and I go back 10, well, if I'm counting by tens backwards from 100, I'll be at 90. And there it is. Let's try it again. 130 minus 70. Man, if I could just make it back to 100, it'd become easier. If I take off 30, I'll be make it back to 100. But I need to take 70. So what's nice is 70 is a multiple of 10. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. If I take off 30, 10, 20, 30, I'm left with, 40. Okay, so I'm left with 40. So 40 and 30 give me 70. I break it apart to make it easier. 130 minus 30 gets me back to 100, and then I have to jump back 40. So 100 minus 40, well, if I have 100 and my fingers are 10s and I take off 40, I'll be left with 60, because I know 6 and 4 is 10. Cha-ching! All right. And if you're like, okay, that's cool. I want it harder. All right, so go to subtraction, make 100, and go to the harder version. Now it becomes harder because we're not just getting back to 100. We're getting back to multiples of 100. So if we're at 240, we're going to try and get back to 200. Well, I'd have to take off that 40. But I need 50 to go away. So if I took 40 off, so here's 50. If I took 40 off, there's 40. I have 10 left. So I'm going to have 10 left over. So 40 and 10 is 50. I break it apart so I can go 240 minus 40 is 200. Then go back another 10. Now if I go back another 10, I won't be in the 200s anymore. I'll be in the 100s. But which 100 will I be at? Well, I only went back 10, so I'm at 190. All right, good luck. Go forth and subtract with make 100.